Savile Row is the epitome of style and sophistication, and today it's overrun with sheep. I'm Harry Parker, farmer from down in southwest Wiltshire. Um, it's an arable beef and sheep farm, and I was approached by Fox Brothers of the Woollen Mill in, down in Somerset to bring a flock of Exmoor horns here. This is to mark Wool Week and to promote wool. These sheep here are, all originate from Exmoor. I went down and bought breeding stock. I breed them now and um, they're a very hardy sheep. They'll nearly live on next to nothing. Produce a very fine wool that can be used. Hi, my name is Thomas Podkalinski and I'm Creative Stroke Design Director at an outdoor company called Finisterre. The reason why we're here today is the Bowman Project. Um, from a Finisterre point of view, originally started around the merino base layers that we do. Uh, we make everything from merino underwear to merino hoodies, um, using the qualities of wool, it being um, amazing at regulating the body temperature, um, and putting it into sort of everyday garments that can be worn very comfortably um, and very easily. It's very, very fine in terms of its micron, and therefore very, very comfortable to wear next to the skin, which is hugely important, especially when you want to relax and be comfortable. And coming down here right on cue. My name's Douglas Cordo. I'm the MD of Fox Brothers, which is the last remaining uh, mill in Somerset. We've been established for nearly 320 years, and uh, we make fine woolen and worsted cloth. Today is um, it's a it's a wool awareness day. It's, uh, it was launched in January. HRH Prince of Wales launched a campaign for wool. And I came away from that meeting absolutely staggered about the lack of use for British wool. We just simply don't use it. It's either hid or put into landfill. So the idea was to bring our local breed, which is the Exmoor Horn, and also show uh, Savile Row in a different way. It's saying that you know Savile Row isn't elitist. There are more artisan skills here, which is the same as the, uh, the farmer that's looking after our countryside. Wool is fully sustainable. It's, uh, it's very breathable, hangs beautifully, you can't do it with anything else. You know, often you think that these things are expensive, but they'll be in your wardrobe ten years after, when you've long forgotten the price of what it costs you. So you've got to look at the quality over the, over the initial outlay, because this is a real investment. And also, a bespoke suit, that's a real investment. It's like, you, you know, it's like buying a grade two listed building. It's, a, it's an artisan um, uh, craft that you, know, you need to buy into.